Hello everyone, I'm Pastor Jimmy Pickett and the verse I want to share with you today is in Psalms chapter 3 verse 7. Uh, what's going on here is, is uh, David is on the run for his life. Uh, his own son Absalom and, and the, and the uh, armies of Israel are pursuing him uh, as Absalom is trying to take the uh, throne. And David says, Arise, O Lord, save me, O my God. Let me tell you something. God is the only one that can save you today. He's the only one that can save us and save this great nation, folks. No man can do that. It says, Save me, O my God, for thou hast smitten all of mine enemies on the cheekbone. Uh, folks, it says in uh, Revelation, or it says in Romans chapter 12, verse 19, it says, uh, Vengeance is mine, saith the Lord, I will repay. Hey, uh, if you love the Lord today and you're doing what you're supposed to be doing and you try to get out each and every day and you're doing what's right, and when I say you, if you love the Lord, that, that is to spend time with Him in His Word, in prayer, going to church, whatever it may be. But when you're trying to do what's right each and every day, I got news for you. God will take care of your enemies. And David had a lot of faith in God, and David loved God, and God loved him. And sure enough, God will uh, continue to make a way for David. But the last part of this verse I really like, okay, but it says... Uh, O oh God, thou hast smitten all mine enemies upon upon the cheekbone. Thou hast broken the teeth of the ungodly. Let me tell you something. I get a lot of hate, a lot of haters, and a lot of trolls uh, on Facebook and and TikTok uh, that say there's no God and that we that we believe in fairy tales. I mean, it was just yesterday a man on TikTok was telling me he says, "Won't you prove to me that there's a God?" And I'm thinking to myself, I wouldn't waste my time proving to him that there is a God. I know there's a God because he dwells within me, folks. And what I love about that verse, and it says, Thou hast broken the teeth of the ungodly. You ever heard that expression when you smarted off as a child? Well, if you keep smarting off to me, I'm going to knock your teeth down your throat. I mean, I can just see it now, boy. When the King of kings and the Lord of lords comes to this earth, folks, he will smite our enemies. And he will He will smite their cheekbone, their cheekbone and he will smack their teeth right down their throat and i got news for them until they accept jesus christ as their lord and savior uh folks they're going to hell and the thing about it is you know these people that mock god and say bad things about god to me even on my ministry page there's one thing about it you leave it whether you accept god as your lord and savior or not every knee shall bow to the king of kings and the lord of lords can i get an amen amen hey god bless you guys hey if this has edified you today hit your share button folks hit your share button hey we are now brought to you by your tithes and offering if we've helped you help us to continue to come to you would you do that uh thank you so much for spending this time with me in the holy word of god